serving you with in-depth international, national, and local news with video coverage from around the world, including comprehensive island reports, weather, and sports. This is Armed Forces Television, Channel 8, the Far East Network, Okinawa. the 26th edition of 10 a.m., the Sunday Morning News Magazine. 26 editions might not mean much to you, but to us it means that we're a half year old. We watched some of the early episodes from early November, six months ago, and we were amazed to see that our camera person, Sue Hutchins, and our audio engineer and electrical engineer, John Kinshawn, have a few more gray hairs. Our director, Bob Walker, doesn't have any more gray hairs. He just doesn't have any more hair having pulled them all out in the course of 26 episodes. But we have had fun bringing 10 a.m. to you. We look forward to bringing it to you in the future. It's definitely been a labor of love. Well, today we figure it's only appropriate to discuss in the next 45 minutes the aging process. That begins the moment we're born. But why we age is still a mystery. And using these strains, we're able to identify where these genes are and then study how they regulate aging. Many are not willing to wait for science to find the answers and are resetting the clock. We're trying to change the effects of gravity and the effects of degeneration. You're either going to age on this face or on the new one. Why we age and how we set back the clock in a special report this morning. Also, some throb, others just nag at us. But we all go through life suffering the frustration of aches and pains. I would get headaches during work or weekends. I couldn't figure out when I would get the headache or why. We don't always know the cause, but in some cases, like arthritis, we're making progress. The body makes an immune response against tissues in the joint. Headache, headache, headache. Headache, headache, headache. And from Japan, this week's profile features Apollonia, the female lead in the rock film Purple Rain, and her love affair with the Japanese. All that and more is coming your way this morning, so stay with us. You could call this in praise of American rivers. They begin high in the Alleghenies. The Connecticut, the Potomac, the Roanoke, the Hudson, the Rappahannock, the Alabama. We made our way into the land of America on the great rivers. The Allegheny, the Monongahela, the Cumberland, the Tennessee, the Ohio. They carried us west into the heartland. The Snake, the Red. The Platte, the Missouri, the Colorado, the Arkansas, and the Rio Grande. And in Alaska, they've got so many rivers, they named one another river. And there it is, the great Mississippi. The name itself conjures up legends. The great American rivers, the bloodstreams that transported Americans into a new country. Old age, a smile on the face of a grandchild, the frustration of not being as sharp as we once were. It means something different to each of us. To scientists, it means unlocking the mysteries of aging. Wendy Waters explores how scientists are helping to improve our old age. <laughs> 